Hi guys, welcome back. I'm currently at the ferries, um, so I've got a lot of time to kill. And I thought I would do a what sold video. Uh, if you don't know, I'm a reseller on eBay and Poshmark, and I particularly sell shoes and mugs. Uh, those are my two favorite things to sell. For the month of July, I didn't do very well in sales, and comparing myself with a few other people, um, it's looking like a few others didn't do quite well uh, this month either, which is, uh, you know, which is always interesting. But I also uh, know that in the summer there's definitely less sales than there are in the winter, obviously. So it wasn't a whole ton, but it was enough to cover my thrift road trip 2.0 that was in my last video. There was a good 12 to 15 days where I wasn't focusing on my store because I was out doing my thrift trip and on top of that I was also preparing for a very large garage sale to you know cut down on that death pile so I only really focused on my eBay store my Poshmark closet for maybe 15 days of the month of July which I believe is also something that contributes to such the low amount in sales that I got um, in the month of July. Um, anyway, I'm going to go through a couple things that I sold during the month of July uh, and let's get started. First up are these Sorel leather sandals. Now if you watch my thrift trip 2.0 you will have seen that I bought these during that thrift trip. Um, they sold within a couple days of me listing them. After shipping and fees I sold them for $23.70. Uh, also side note this is all in Canadian dollars not US dollars. Next up are these women's choco black sandals. Now, uh, I'm surprised. I have been finding so many choco sandals lately and I don't know why I've never seen them before. It could be just now that I'm aware of them and I've been bypassing them this whole time, which is super unfortunate, but also, side note, thrift shops don't know the value of choco sandals yet, so every time I find them, they're priced low. And I'm like, yes, so, uh, hoping they don't figure out what they are. I'm sure this video probably doesn't help that, but it makes me really, really happy when I do find them because they're always super cheap and I can sell them for super high. These Chocos Women Sandals, I sold them for $30 plus $20 shipping. Next up is another pair of Women's Choco Sandals, a, a different style with blue webbing. These ones I also sold for $30 plus $17 shipping. Next up are Vintage Adidas Samba 62 Leather Soccer Men's Shoes. I found these a few months ago and they sat in the store for a little while and I actually had a really hard time finding sold comps or any or anything on these shoes, but in the end I sold them for $26 with $15 shipping. Another pair of women's choco sandals. This pair I sold for $40 plus $17 shipping. Next up are these Vans men's shoes. After shipping and fees, these were $19.75. Next up are these red Reebok CrossFit runners, which I sold for $15.80 Canadian. mug sales. I won't get too in depth with that because it can get quite tedious because there are a lot and I generally sell in bundles and if I went through every single mug that sold in each bundle it get very very long. First up is this three mug bundle. Generally what I do with the less expensive mugs that are in my store you have the option to bundle them up and you can get three for thirty and this is precisely what this person did. They bundled three mugs together and they got them all for thirty dollars. After shipping and fees it was twenty dollars and fifty cents for my second bundle set another person bought three mugs for thirty after shipping and fees it was twenty dollars and fifty cents so last up is this giant bundle that i sold to a reoccurring customer so i gave her a fantastic deal because she is a recurring customer and she's super loyal so i sold it so this giant bundle to her for fifty dollars after shipping and fees it was thirty nine dollars and fifty cents which I understand is not ideal, but because she's a recurring customer and she loves kind of almost everything in my store, I'm happy to give her a deal. 